For this equation, baking soda plus hydrochloric acid yields sodium chloride plus carbon dioxide plus water. We have all of the elements that are in the equation written down on both sides, reactants and products. Let's count them up. We have one sodium, we have one hydrogen, and actually we've got another hydrogen. So we have two hydrogens. We have one carbon, three oxygens, and then the one chlorine. Over on the product side, we have the one sodium. And let's just go in the same order here. We have the two hydrogens. Carbons, we have one. Oxygens, we have two. But we've got this other one here. We need to add that. So three oxygen atoms and then one chlorine atom. When we look at the equation here, you'll notice that everything's the same on both sides of the equation, meaning that this neutralization reaction is already balanced. The NaHCO3 plus HCl, that gives us the NaCl, CO2, NH2O, but everything's the same on each side of the equation. If you're having problems with this equation, it's likely that you didn't add up both of the hydrogens on the reactants or all of these oxygens, the two here and the one here on the product side. That's usually where people run into problems. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for NaHCO3 plus HCl yields NaCl plus CO2 plus H2O. And thanks for watching.